Hey guys, it's Chelsea, and today, um, oh god, you can like see my reflection. Um, um, I just got back from doing some more dorm shopping. I'm actually leaving tomorrow to go to my school, and I'm just doing, let me shut the door. I feel like my dog's gonna come in here and just interrupt everything. Um, but yeah, so... I just purchased some new things and I've made some more purchases since I made my dorm video. Just wanted to share those with you guys and give you just some more advice, things I've learned about packing and etc. So you're not really going to be seeing me in this video, I'm just going to like show you the things but I thought I would at least have my intro showing my face. <laughs> but yeah, this outfit of the day y'all. <laughs> and um, here we go. So I'll start with the stuff I just purchased. Yeah, it's like a mess over there now trying to pack everything. But I found this three drawer storage cart at Bed Bath & Beyond and I thought it was um, because the issue is I don't think I'm going to have enough storage for everything I want to bring. And because um, all I have is like an armoire and I, that's like all I have to keep my clothes in. So um, I got this. I'm hoping it's going to fit. It's nice because it rolls and it has a countertop on it so I can put stuff. Um, when I looked at it in the store, it was like kind of skinnier. I have some drawers over there, but first of all, they're pink, so they're not going to really match much. And they're just kind of fat. So <laughs> um, this one was a nice happy medium and it was only $39.99. This was the last blue. I didn't think they'd be sold out of the blue, but they pretty much were. This was the last one. It was like way in the back and the girl had to get a ladder to get it, but I'm really glad she did because it's really cute. And then also from Bed Bath & Beyond, um, what's in here? Oh, I got a power strip and I really enjoyed this one because of its just unique qualities. Um, this is the Power Curve and it's surge protected, which is really awesome. Um, you can buy cheaper ones. This one was $34.99, but um, they don't come with as many great qualities as this one. This one's great because um, you can actually tilt the power thing, so that way you can plug in more bigger things. Um, not saying I have like huge plug-ins, but I don't know <laughs> what I'm going to have, so got that, and then it has the grounded protected, and it also has two places to plug in USB so like my phone or something so um yeah I thought it was a good buy and it was a little expensive but I think it was worth it so yep and then the only other thing I got were some K cups um yeah these were like $26.99 but it came with $48 so it was just a better deal um, this is the coffee we drink at my house, so I just got that again. And yeah, we used, we had a 20% off coupon, the ones that said that on are always sending out that like never expire. Um, so we used it on, no, it actually came off of this, and so we got $8 off of that. And then from Kirkland's, um, they had like three for five on these scent things, so my mom got two and then I got one. And these are so amazing, you guys. I've never really been into these because I, you know, I'm like 18. And these, I think these are more from like another generation. Like on, like people don't really use these anymore. But they're so great if you're going to college because you can't have candles. So instead of spraying stuff all the time, you can put one of these. She said not to put it on a wood surface because the oils in it will kind of eat it up over time. And, you know, eat the finish off. But this is really great to just put somewhere in your room. And it'll make your room smell really, really nice. So, got one of those from Kirkland's. And then also, um, this isn't necessarily a necessity, but it's just something cute um, to kind of, I don't know, make your room cuter. It is this um, little vasey kind of thing. This was only $2.99. It was marked down to $2.99. And it's really great. You can put like pencils or for me being a makeup person, put makeup in it. But it's just really nice. You can buy fake flowers from like the Dollar Tree, put it in here. It's just a nice touch. And they had this in all different colors. And you definitely don't need to go to Kirkland's. But it's really nice to get um, just kind of a different, I guess you could call it piece to put in your room on your desk or whatever. Because all college rooms pretty much come with a desk. Okay, so over here is very overwhelming. Um, I've gotten a few things 
and added a, a lot to this pile. Um, I've gotten that over the door mirror from Walmart. Kind of regretting it a little bit just because um, it was it was cheap. But I found a lot of other mirrors for relatively the same price that have a lot more decoration. And um, like I found one that had slits so you could put photos in it which was really cool but I'm really lazy about returning and it's gonna do the job so why not um but yeah pretty much all of my stuff I've kind of added um this bulletin board doesn't go with anything but um again I'm really lazy about going out and buying and I don't want to spend the extra money so I'm just gonna bring that I'm also bringing that little vacuum I talked to my roommate about it um we're not sure if we're gonna need it but she was debating on buying one so I was like hey well you know, I already have one. We'll bring it. If we don't need it, I'll bring it home next time I go home. And, um, yeah, as far as packing wise goes, um, it's been a little bit of a task. Uh, I have two suitcases full of clothes and I really want to talk to you guys about these suitcases because they are awesome. They are not like your average, put that over there. They are not like your average suitcases. These are, I guess the brand is He's. I don't know how you say that, but um, they came like one another. So this was a big one. Then there was that one. And then there was that little one over there. And what's great about these is they all came with um, these little lock thing. So it's cool. It comes with a lock for each of them. And I'm not really going to use those. But what's great is the amount of storage you get inside. Um, I don't know if you guys can see, but that is a large pile of clothes that's getting really wrinkly right now. But, um, yeah, this is, this is really great because it's different than a regular suitcase, which would have like the flat top where, um, it would be hard to fit stuff in. This suitcase has a really high top, so you can get a, tons of clothes in there. And it also has a, like, I call it the stretcher zipper where you unzip it and it stretches it out so you can fit more. So I can actually fit more clothes than are in here and I'm probably going to take advantage of that. And then it's just the same thing in that one, just a pile of clothes. And then, um, this is the little one that I'm packing like perfumes and then like all the stuff I'm planning to put like on my desk and things like that. So there's all that. And then, um, there is this uh, fan. I actually unboxed it. I'm bringing it with me to college, but um, it's really loud. Like I want you guys to hear, it said like three quiet settings. Let me show you the three quiet settings. This is one. Oh, this is one. Yeah, okay, that's fine. That's two and then three. like a jet taking off I'm just like oh my god so I talked to my roommate about it and she's willing to try it out I was like listen it's kind of loud and she's like no that's fine like I'm used to fans we'll try it and I told her you know if it was a big deal then I'll take it home um as far as packing purposes it's been kind of rough I've been using any bag I could find I put like all my beauty stuff in there um it's uh it's such a struggle um i did come up with the idea i think it was kind of creative if you're bringing some sort of basket to put all of your organizing and maybe kind of little cleaning ish things in it um it just it's going to make it easier instead of trying to put this like i'm going to put nail polishes in this and trying to put nail polishes in it and things um this i already have like a folder thing this is going to be for my makeup palettes that I'm choosing to bring. I know I'm crazy. Um, and then little organizers. Um, I pretty much am bringing any organizer I have um, that I know I'm just gonna like have some sort of room for. And then this shoe box is for putting like bathing suits and stuff in. And then um, I'm bringing this little duster that I got at the Dollar Tree and this basket is from the Dollar Tree. Um, Dollar Tree, like <laughs> some like cheapy yard sale thing. Obviously this is a shoe box. And then I believe this, this is from like the Dollar Tree or something. Um, but yeah, I'm bringing like every organizing thing I have. As far as for, <laughs> none of this stuff matches because this is all random stuff for my room. Like I used to do my nails on that. Now I'm going to bring it to like put my computer on and stuff. But um, I'm bringing this organizer that keeps all of my hair stuff. So I don't know how well this is going to do traveling, but I don't want to unpack it because this, the, it's like all like little little things so I feel like it's gonna go everywhere but um yeah so bringing that and then as far as makeup um 
if you watch my makeup collection video I have like a huge thing of makeup I have condensed it this isn't my daily makeup this is makeup I just want to bring um, but I've condensed it all what I want to bring into this container so that was pretty cool and yeah so this is everything not everything I'm bringing I still have more to pack today but um yeah this is just like an overview um I have this huge bag from Fredericks that's keeping all of my shoes um I've just kind of singled everything out into bags um I'm bringing bags that's gonna be the book bag I'm using I guess because I'm I haven't found one yet that I liked so I'm using that um and then as far as for hangers, I'm bringing them in a trash bag. I know some people have said to bring like those slimline hangers or whatever, like the slim hangers, but um, they were kind of expensive. I mean, they weren't expensive, but it was like like 20 something dollars at Bed Bath & Beyond for a pack of 50, which isn't expensive. It's just money I didn't want to spend when it's like I already have hangers, although not as efficient. Um, but yeah, and then I like, I'm bringing some robes and things like that. Um, but yeah, I mean, other than that, the only other little thing that I've bought, I'm bringing a sleeping bag in case someone wants to come over, is this little laundry bag from Ross. And it's pretty cool because it turns into a backpack. So, and they had a bunch of different colors and stuff. So, thought that was cool. But yeah, um, that is pretty much it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I would give you guys kind of packing advice, but I don't really have any. Pretty much use whatever you can to bring stuff over. Um, you know, a lot of people go out and buy all these bins and things like that, but I'm just kind of like, um, <laughs> I'm just kind of throwing everything in bags that I already have because I'm, honestly, you guys, I'm going to a private university and I'm spending more money than you can imagine to go there. So um, I am kind of cutting corners as, and cutting costs as much as I can. So that's just my way of cutting costs. Um, you know, stores are always giving out like Victoria's Secret, Fredericks, places like that are constantly giving out like free bags that are huge and it's like you know they're only good for like sleepovers and stuff like that so this is a perfect time to bring all those bags out if you don't have any for yourself you could definitely use shopping bags um you know when it comes as it's getting closer to um, that time to move of course you're gonna go shopping and stuff save your shopping bags because if you're buying big items you're gonna have big bags and you can put stuff in there or borrow some of your friends um, but don't you there's no it's not necessary to go out and buy all these big bins and things like that because it's like where you're gonna put them after you know your parents can take them home but it's like where are they gonna go and um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm actually doing more shopping today. I'm going to be going back to Walmart and getting kind of little things like shampoo, conditioner. Um, it's kind of weird like rebuying all the stuff that I have, but it's like I need it for myself because right now it's for like me and my sister. But yeah, so this is really depressing making this. Um, my parents are all distraught because my sister's in college but she's staying at home so I'm the little bird that's flying away <laughs> but yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this video um this might be my last video for a little bit just because I don't know how my roommate's gonna be with filming or you know I don't know how to break it to her <laughs> like hey I film videos and I don't know how it's gonna go down with all that but we'll see how it goes and maybe I'll make a video with her or maybe who knows, but um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, yeah, I hope you found some kind of advice from it. And um, if you, if this is the first video you're watching, I have a whole dorm room haul and advice video if you wanna go watch that one as well. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time here on Makeup by Chelsea and bye-bye.